perfect. Hey guys, it's your girl Arnisha Nicole and welcome back to my channel for another video. If you are new to my channel, make sure you stop what you're doing and go ahead and subscribe and click the notifications bell so you can be notified whenever I upload a new video. And if you are a returning subscriber, hey boo, thanks for coming back. Look, y'all, let me go ahead and get started because <sighs> she about to get on my nerves. But anyway. Okay guys, so the wig I'm reviewing for you all today is Otre's Shantea, Shantea. Um, she's a lace front wig, well lace front part. She has Swiss eye parting, so it's in the shape of an eye. Um, she's heat resistant up into 400 degrees Fahrenheit. I got her in a car color DRFF1B27, so it has the highlights in the front kind of like face framing um i picked her up from samsbeauty.com for i think she was 34 dollars hold on all right she was 34 dollars and 99 cents but since this is considered a specialty color um it's a two dollar upcharge it's 36.99 and she's currently sold out on sam's beauty but don't worry guys i'll make sure um I link other uh, companies down below where you can purchase her um, from if you like this review. Um, she has Swiss lace parting. She has two combs in the front, a comb at the nape, and adjustable straps. At first, I didn't think Homegirl was going to be a big hair friendly, but she fits pretty good. I have a wig cap on, and I have my wig grip, so that kind of makes it a little snug um, to your head. Um, okay. So the pros, I, I like the color. I like the face frame. I like how it has the 27 and then it has like a little brown and then a 1B. Um, I like, I really like the color blend. I like that she um, is big head friendly. Um, and the parting space is nice. The, it looks really good right now, now that I'm looking at it on camera. It did have some like filler hairs in the part, but you could easily pluck them if they bother you. Um, I really don't pluck like that, so I just went ahead and put my press powder, my Fit Me, Fit Me press powder in the color 360 in my part and called it a day. And that was it. And you know, I had my edges swooped on the side. Y'all know how I do with my edges, my baby hairs. So those are the pros. I do like the color blend. This was done very nicely. I like the part. I like that she's big head friendly. Um, oh, I'm sorry. I got gum in my mouth, y'all. You're not supposed to have gum in your mouth when you're doing like videos and stuff. But anyway, but let me tell y'all the cons about this unit. I don't know how I feel about the style. Looks cute on homegirl. 
but I feel like I had curls, you know, throughout the wig and they flopped. Like I'm I'm not feeling whatever they was trying to do with this curl. Um I really got this wig because it reminded me of the Bobby Boss Evangeline unit that um recently came out but it's like a little shorter um so i was like oh and it was a little more cheaper so i was like let me get this this is cute but i i'm not feeling this style on me but that's a personal that's a personal preference now let me get i, I don't really like how the curl thing like me i should have just got another valentino if i wanted to flip back but that's on me but the second kind and i know y'all been seeing me pulling hair off of myself so far i cut the lace and she has been shedding baby let me tell you something she's been shedding i don't know if y'all can see all that because it's following my face my camera's striking my face but she's shedding like a dog baby she's shedding like a dog shedding like a dog and i'm just like i don't have time for that i don't have time for hair all over the place so the cur I, I don't I, I don't really like the cur it's like a flop like it, it I don't like that and I I don't like that <laughs> but um I don't like that and I don't like the shedding um and those are like the two major cons for me uh the hair texture girl I don't even know what type of texture this is I'm not gonna say it feels like baby hair because it doesn't and it's I'll say it's like a light yakky because it has a little bit of thickness to it, but it just feels rough in here. It feels really rough. I don't like that. Like it's fresh out the pack, sis. And it and it's and it, the shedding. I'm about to get pissed. <laughs> to get mad. The shedding. I don't like it. Um, but I think it's like a light uh, yakky texture. I, I just don't like the texture. I'm not feeling the texture. Uh. I'm not going to get rid of this unit. I'll probably put some perm rods in it and, you know, spice it up like I usually do. But, I mean, if this doesn't bother you, the shedding doesn't bother you, and you like the style, I always say go ahead and get it. Use your own preference, honey. The wig will not look like it looks on me on you. It, it, it just, it all, the wigs look different on everybody. So, use your own discretion or decision making when purchasing these wigs but I the shedding did it for me the shedding did it for me it, it keeps shedding there's no reason why the wig should be fresh out the pack and it's shedding like this but um the color is cute the parting baby I like the parting I like the color blend but the texture and the shedding I can't do it and I feel like this is just gonna get real um stiff at the bottom and, and and we don't do stiff wigs we don't do stiff wigs so what i recommend this right now um it's a no for me dog um i would just say go ahead and get valentino and valentino lasts a long ass time and she's only 19.99 um the last time i checked so i would recommend that wig and i also have a video on that so I'll link it up here at the top and you guys can go and see the Valentino review and you can also see the two week update that I had about it. So, um, yeah, y'all, y'all see, I didn't got real chill lean back cause I'm like, whatever, but I'll probably, um, put some perm rods in here and call it a day. But yeah, guys, let me know what y'all think, um, down below in the comments. I could be tripping. Most people probably be like, oh, it looks nice on you, but you know how you feel when you put on a unit and you ain't feeling it. Alright y'all, I gotta get out this week. So I love y'all. Be safe. Stay home. Take care of yourself. Take care of your family. Stay in the house. Um, so just make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video with your friends. And I love you guys so much. And thank you guys for watching. And oh, thank y'all for uh getting me the 7K, honey. Not 7K. Oh, I wish. One day. But thank y'all for getting me to 700 subscribers. I appreciate you guys so much. And... Yeah, that's all for me today, y'all. And like I always say, peace.